Hey there, Elevate. Great to have you here this morning. It's going to be a great, great morning. Uh, we've got a guest with us this morning, one of my good friends, Ryan Layden. So let me tell you a little bit about Ryan. Uh, Ryan's from Texas. Okay, enough about Ryan. Let's talk about Texas. Uh, in fact, I want to test your knowledge of Texas with a little game I like to call Texas True or False. The way this game goes is I'm going to ask five questions and you'll have three seconds to say to the person next to you whether you think this is true or false. At the end of it, give yourself a score out of five. So, you ready? Here goes. Question number one. In 1996, a Texas man was bitten by a deadly coral snake. He killed the snake by biting off the snake's head and used the decapitated body as a tourniquet. True or false? Tick, 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 yeehaw! The answer is in fact true. Okay, question number two. Houston Airport received many complaints about baggage wait times. In response, they moved baggage claim further away so that the walk was longer than the wait. The number of complaints dropped. True or false? Tick, 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 yeehaw! That is also true. Would you shut up with those horses' hooves? Question number three. During World War II, the song Deep in the Heart of Texas was banned by the BBC during work hours on the grounds that, and I quote, its infectious malady might cause factory hands to neglect their tools while they clapped in time with the song. Is that true or false? Tick, 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 yeehaw! That, my friends, is true. The stars at night are big and bright, deep in the heart of Texas. She's not going to steal our idea. What idea? We're going to write an The prairie sky that. is wide and high, deep in the heart okay, stop, stop. of Texas. Question number four. The Dallas Cowboys haven't actually played football in Dallas since 1971. True or false? Tick, 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 yeehaw! Also true. Now, Ryan, I hope you're four for four at this stage. Going into the final question, question number five, here goes. In March 2008, the University of Texas was accused of plagiarizing a portion of Brigham Young University's honor code related to cheating and plagiarism. True or false? Tick, 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 yeehaw! Yes, sorry to say, that's also true. So, give yourself a score out of five. Now, back to Ryan. A little bit about Ryan. Uh, in fact, I could have gotten Louisa to introduce uh, Ryan to you today. Um, but for some reason, she's got her uh, wires crossed in her brain and uh, has come to conclude, or, or often gets confused, thinking his name is not Ryan, but in fact Randy. Which, in America, would be okay, because Randy is a name. But as you and I well know, here in Australia, Randy's not a name, it's a feeling. So I thought, Best, keep it safe, keep it PG. I'll introduce Ryan this morning. Ryan is from Texas. Uh, he's become a good friend of mine. He's a straight shooter, which yes, I know also means something different in Texas. And it's one of the reasons I like him. And he leads Warnborough Community Church, which is a great and growing church in our southern corridor of Perth. And uh, he's uh, made time to be with us this morning, invest into us on our journey as we're chasing 200. So how about you give a great... Elevate welcome this morning to Ryan, Randy, Layden. <laughs> 